No, this video is actually not clickbait. I am going to be piercing my own ears. Random disclaimer really quick. I just want to say that this video is not graphic, but you can see a little like dot of blood where I pierced my ear. I know some people when they see a drop of blood like it doesn't go well for them so if you are one of those people I'd click off. If you aren't like don't worry it's not graphic it's not like it's gross you know because I'm piercing my ear so there's a little dot of blood. If you just keep watching I do start crying and it gets interesting. <laughs> yes I'm actually serious I'm going to pierce my own ears today. I have two holes in each of them and I'm going to be doing the third hole myself, kind of. I'm going to explain on this while I put ice on them because I want to kind of try to numb them. Please subscribe if you've never seen my channel. My videos aren't usually like this, but this is an ice pack under here, by the way. If you've never seen my channel, hi, I'm Julia. Welcome back. Today we're doing some interesting things for the YouTube. You might be wondering why I'm not just going to a professional place and getting my ears pierced. There's a story that goes along with this that I'll be telling really quick first. I have three piercings on each ear. I really like them. Something happened where they started to get infected and it was really weird because it's not like I just got any pierced. The last ones I got pierced were in June. I start taking my earrings out like for a little bit putting them in because the third ones are still kind of sensitive to taking them out like they'll just close after a little. So I didn't want to take them out for too long but I would take them out to help them heal but they just kept getting worse. Finally I ended up going to a doctor and the doctor was like well what earrings were you wearing and I was like I don't really know what they were but I've been wearing them for a while. I've had them for a long time and she's like well you developed an allergy to them so you're now allergic to those earrings and I was like well makes sense that they were getting worse they got so bad that I ended up not being able to put earrings in for a week or two and last night I tried to put my earrings in I got the first two in the second one was a struggle but the third one not at all like I can see the hole I know where it's supposed to be like it'll go in a little but not all the way. Today, I decided to numb them and just redo it myself because I don't want to pay to get it done again when I just did that in summer. Like, first of all, I would have to wait like six months to do that because my ears aren't even completely healed yet, but we're just going for this anyway. I don't think this numbed them at all. I'm going to go wash my hands to make sure they're completely clean because I don't want another ear infection, so I'm trying to make sure everything's so clean. And these are the new earrings I got. I had to get hypoallergenic earrings, which is earrings for people who have allergic reactions to earrings which apparently ended up being me but these are nickel free cubic zirconia and i was wearing cubic zirconia before so i could be allergic to that and then i'm going to put these in alcohol i'm going to fill the cap of this little container with it and i'm going to put dip the earrings in them because that way when they go in my ear they're completely clean because my infection was so bad i have like lotion pills i'm not going to go into the details of that because i know some people like can't handle if i like started describing it so i'm not going to but it was just not good i have a cup of water that i'm also like i'm going to wipe water on them like they do at the and I'm going to use sanitizer to make sure my hands are so clean. So now I'm going to dip this napkin in some ice water. <laughs> yeah, this might really not go well. I don't know if you guys can even see this, but... Okay, so first I need to find where the hole was. Ow! Ha! Huh. <laughs> it already hurts. Okay, I got it a little bit in. And I just need to like keep taking it in and out and like pushing it a little more each time. I don't know if you guys can see it, but there is now a ring of blood. Here, this was not a good idea. <laughs> I'm trying to just push it. I won't go. <laughs> ah! It keeps bleeding more. What does that mean? Is it getting further? I can't tell. It's like, oh, it's like, look at that. It's like bleeding now. It's like, yeah. <laughs> why am I literally like this dramatic? It's not that deep. It's really not. It's just my ear. Like, I'll be fine if I just put it in. Mood to this video, hashtag changed. By the way, every time there gets blood on the thing and I take it out, I do re-dip it in the alcohol because that way, like, I can re-sanitize it. It's almost there, and <laughs> it really is. I think, like, I think I can do it. Like, actually, if I just keep going, I wanna, <laughs> I wanna do it so bad, like, cause I'll be, like, really frustrated if I don't. <sighs> so what I'm doing, by the way, is just, like, putting it in, pushing, 
and then taking it out and like pushing more and i don't really know if i'm getting anywhere with this but it seems to be it's just like really bothering me because i don't like blood or like like this is like hurting myself and i don't like that so it's really bothering me like to like because i like look at the blood and i have to put the earring right back there and it like that's like what's really annoying me huh <laughs> yeah i should just pose for a thumbnail because i'm actually crying i figured it's the right time sophia shout out to you because you are being a pro and sophia just texted me and asked me how it went and well it didn't yet actually <sighs> I really don't know if I'm gonna think this is like funny after or if I'm just gonna cut all this out like if I leave it in it could be such good content but I'm actually genuinely upset because I want it to like go through but it hurts so bad <laughs> Haley said Julia no is it working now no <laughs> Sophia said she wants the full version <laughs> uncensored. That's your live footage of Sophia and Haley um, making me feel better. Oh yeah, if you're trying to finish your own ears, um, I guess just text your friends and when they ask you for the full version of you crying in your video, it can kind of make you laugh. <laughs> it went almost through. I felt it, I felt it, I got this, I got this, I got this, I got this, I got this. Like, I felt the skin, like, going. Like, it's coming. It's coming, guys. I got this. I numbed it so well. It is a few days later, and basically after the clip that you guys just saw, my camera was about to run out of battery, so I started recording on my phone. On that video, I pierced my ear. It's there. It worked. I did it. I have two other ones, too, but I don't have them in today. Then, I was gonna put it in my YouTube video. Of course... I accidentally deleted it off my phone. That was a clip of me piercing my ear. So I'm still posting this anyway because my friends found it pretty funny. Just so you guys know, I did pierce my ear. All that happened was I just like went like this and like I said, it was almost through and I just literally like did it the next time and it went through. So like you didn't really miss anything that exciting. It just went through and I was like, yay. This one was the second one I did and that one actually didn't close up. I thought it did, but it didn't. So that one, I just stuck through and it hurt a little, but it's fine. They're all good now. If you like this video, please like and subscribe. Comment down below and let me know what you think. Let me know if you want more videos like this, if you found this funny, and I'll see you guys next week. Bye.